Today, education is not just a, a piece of a paper called a certificate. Education today is to empower you to be what you want to be. Getting started up in business is difficult, and a large part is knowing how to run your enterprise. Business Buzz went along to find out from the Informal Business Training Trust about courses that they run, giving you, the businessman, a solid grounding in understanding how business works. So you want to start a business and be your own boss? You want to make a profit, surely not a loss. Then there's only one way for you to go, and that's to find the gap and go for it. Oh, go, go for it. Go, 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 go for it. That's the boss you want to be. You got to find the gap and go for it. Wow. Finding the gap is one thing, but starting a business without some form of business skills can be disastrous. Where do you go for help? One organization that can help is the IBTT, otherwise known as the Informal Business Training Trust. So you want to start a business and be your own boss? You want to make a profit? Shall I spoke to Cedric Buffler to find out what they offer, the entrepreneur. The One Up program was built from the bottom up. Uh, we found out at an early stage that the um, first world principles didn't necessarily work at grassroots level. So we built the course from the bottom up. And the, uh, the course now consists of eight modules, starting with market investigation. You, you walk down any street in any city and you find that people copy each other. Somebody's selling oranges, somebody next door is selling oranges. So what we do is we say, if you haven't got a gap, you don't have a business. You must first find something that nobody else is doing or that the community needs. We emphasize the need to do your costings properly. We have a money management system rather than a bookkeeping system. Uh, it's not important for a small business person to know what a cash book and the ledger and the journal is. They need to manage their money. So all of our money management fits onto one page. And uh, we talk about how to write a simple business plan because later on they'll need that skill. But basically we give people just enough so that they have enough information, enough knowledge to run the business. The, this manufacturing skill before they understand business. We feel that people will just go into business without understanding business, then they'll mess up things, you see, and things won't go well. So that's why we decided to bring them here to IPTT to get the knowledge of how to run the business. No bangela or bandia qua IPTT. No bandi, then Funa Ukwasi, Ukutela is Dorque, Jukwas Gubala in Maliam, and Tenganga is Dorque, Nemali, your band Teng is Dor, Nemali, your Tindi Patale Aban to Abadam Medisa, Dinga Kake, Dinga Dinga, I came on to any end. We realized all businesses aren't the same, so we have a course now for traders and one for producers and one for service providers, and uh, it's now available in six different languages. It's hope and it's soul. We leave our footprints for history. Somebody told me about ITT. I thought, oh, I don't really need it. Um, like she told me that they can teach you even how to work on a, a calculator. 
I thought a calculator who doesn't know how to work with a calculator. But when I was there, I realized that a calculator is important and I thought I know uh, too much and I didn't know anything. Um, an independent firm of auditors uh, last year did a survey at Orange Farm and the survey was of people who'd been trained by IBTT over the previous 18 months. And this uh, firm of auditors found that of the people who had been trained, 81% of them were economically active. Before I started with uh, IBTT, the way I used to run business, it was unprofessional in the sense that I didn't record anything. Uh, the money I spent, or whatever I buy, or whatever I gain or lose. I didn't know whether I'm gaining or losing. It was just a matter of just operating, doing the business, you see. I didn't know at least how much have I made, let's say within a week's time or a day's, day's time. I was just to take the money, and at the same time, that money, I didn't know that I've got to have a, a special money or a separate money for my business or for my wages or salary, whatever. It was just one thing. I used to say, this is my money and it ends there. Whenever I spend it, I didn't care how I spend it. I've got a direction now. Your duty now know where is going. go down, you know. Go down and see who is there who need light. Because those who are in the street need your light now. You are the candle on top of the table to give light to those who are in the darkness. Go out as soldiers, be fishers of men, be fishers of your brothers and sisters who are in the street being used today to fend violet, violence. Frank Fredericks is a building contractor operating in Cape Town townships. I wanted to be more creative. I wanted to do things on my own. I wanted to be my own boss and I decided to take the gap. I did the course at IVTT and after that things really started moving for me. I've got a very a unique system that they've trained me in to do the things that will make you successful in your business. That is the gap that I took by saying to myself that the job costing that I learned at IVTT and going out there and pricing your material, pricing your labor, making sure that you can still make a reasonable profit, that's where I took the gap. At the moment I've got eight uh, artisans and laborers working for me. They've each got families, they also share in the profits that I make, which is another edge or another gap that I've given them to take.